So jumping straight into one of the first steps that you need to take, which is that you obviously need to sign up for a ChatGPT account, or if you've already got one, you need to log into it. So I've just logged into my one over here, and you may notice right here that it says ChatGPT Plus, which means that I'm paying monthly for the premium account. But even if you've got the free account, you're still gonna be able to follow all the steps that I'm gonna lay out in this video. So one of the first steps that you can take if you're completely confused on what type of website you wanna build is that you're gonna be able to ask ChatGPT something along the lines of, can you give me 10 niche ideas for a profitable blog website? And then click on enter. And just like that instantly, ChatGPT has come back with all of these different ideas that I'm gonna be able to choose from where I'm gonna be able to make a lot more money than if I was to come up with an idea myself. So that's one of the first ways that you're gonna be able to use it. And some of the ideas that it came back with is sustainable living, adventure and travel, personal finance for millennials, vegan and plant-based. According to ChatGPT, it believes that all of these different ideas are going to bring me a decent amount of money. But of course, from this stage, you just wanna make sure that you pick a category or a niche that you're going to send to your website around that you have passion in and that you have some sort of knowledge in. Because even though it's telling me that something like DIY and crafts is a highly profitable niche, I don't have any interest in it. I don't care about that. So I'm not necessarily going to go with this one. However, when it comes to topics like personal finance, even things like vegan and plant-based, because if you guys don't know, I was actually vegan for around six years. So I may want to build a website around this. But for the purposes of today's video, let's say if I wanted to build a website around this one over here, personal finance for millennials, the next question that you can ask once you're at this stage is something like, can you give me an idea of what types of affiliate products I can promote within the personal finance for millennials niche? And then click on enter again. And just like that, I've now got an idea of all of these different types of services and products I can look for when it comes to signing up for all of these different affiliate programs. Things like credit monitoring services, high interest savings accounts, online courses, credit card offers. I now have an idea of the types of products and services I'm gonna be able to promote when it comes to doing affiliate marketing on my website. So now that I've got an idea of what my central theme of the website is gonna be about, which is personal finance for millennials, and I've also got an idea of the types of affiliate offers I'm going to promote, I can now move over to some of the practical steps that I'm gonna take when it comes to building the physical website. So the first step is that you're going to need to come over to Hostinger. And the reason why you're gonna come over to Hostinger is because they've got a really good AI builder that you're gonna be able to use in conjunction with ChatGPT. And of course, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can do that in a moment. So if you use the link in my description down below, you're gonna be able to get around 75% off your hosting plan. And it's not gonna be that expensive as well. It's gonna be as low as $2 per month, and you're gonna be able to get around two months for completely free. Now, when it comes to the package that you should pick, it all depends on what type of site you're looking to build. You can pick the premium one, you're gonna be able to pick the business one. And if you do use that link in my description down below, you're gonna be able to also get a free domain. So for now, I'm gonna click on this one over here, which is free 99 a month. So if I just add this to my cart, from this point, Hosting is then gonna ask you how long do you want to have the website for? So you're gonna be able to select 48 months if you want, 24 months. Now the one that I normally pick is around 12 months or around 24 months, depending on what type of site I'm looking to build. And bear in mind, even if you pick one month or any of these other options, you're always gonna have the option to extend. The only reason why they give you these four different options initially is because if you do select a longer period, it's gonna be cheaper over the long term. So you're gonna select whichever one that you wanna select. So I'm gonna leave it as 24 months from now. Then what I'm gonna do is come down here and show you that you're gonna be able to save even more money if you click on have a coupon code. And if you just enter this code over here and click on apply, you're gonna be able to save a little bit more money if you do enter this code. All right, so once you've completed that entire process and you've logged into your Hostinger account, this is a similar page to what you're going to see. From here, you're gonna be able to claim your free domain. And when I say domain for anyone out there that doesn't know what this is, this is simply www. followed by your website name.com. So that's one of the good things about using Hostinger is that you're gonna be able to save a little bit more money. So all you need to do from this point is just click on claim domain just like this. From here, you're gonna be able to check the availability for your chosen name. So of course, if you've already got a name that you want to use, then you're gonna simply type it in here. But if you've got no idea 
on what your domain should be or you can't think of any idea, then what you can do is come back over to ChatGPT and you're gonna be able to ask it something like, can you give me 10 domain ideas for, and then simply copy the niche that you're going to work on. In this case, it's personal finance for millennials. So I'm just gonna paste it in there just like that and then click on send message. And instantly we've got these 10 different names that we're gonna be able to choose from. So from this point, it's gonna be a simple case of just going through and seeing which one is available for us to use because of course not all of them are gonna be available. So if I just try the first one, just paste it in there just like that and click on check availability. Okay, perfect. We got lucky on our first try. So the first one, is available from here I'm going to be able to click on claim domain but of course I'm only showing you this as an example so I'm not going to select it in this case but if you are happy with the domain and you know that you're going to have to use it over the long term you could just simply click on this option and proceed to the steps when it comes to designing your website and once you are happy to start building out your website you're going to select this option over here then what you're going to do is click on these three dots and then click on change template it's going to ask you to confirm and say that you're happy to change the template so i'm going to click on that option from here you're going to have all of these different templates to choose from but of course we're using the ai website builder so you can select this option over here that says try the ai website builder so i'm just going to click on this and as you guys can see over here it says they're going to be able to create your website in under a minute so i'm going to click on start creating and you're going to simply need to fill out these three different options the brand name the website type and a short description so again this is where chat gpt is going to be able to help so because we already know what the brand name is i'm just going to copy it just like this and paste it in there just like that for website type we already know that it's going to be a blog so i'm going to select that and for the description section you're going to be able to type this out yourself because you could just type in a few sentences but if you wanted the help of chat gpt you're going to be able to ask it something along the lines of i want to create a website using an ai website builder can you give me a short description to paste into the ai tool for it to create a website that will educate millennials on how to manage their personal finances it will be called millennial money hacks something like that should be okay and if you just send this message just like that it should instantly come back with a description that you're going to be able to copy just like this come back over to hostinger paste it in there just like that they said that it's a great description and then i simply need to click on this option just like that and then from this point it should take under a minute maybe 30 seconds in some cases it could take two minutes but whatever the case is i'm gonna be back as soon as the website is done okay guys there we go the website is now complete and this is what it looks like this is the first draft of course we're gonna have to go through and make sure that we're happy with everything but we're going to be able to get a rough idea of what the website is going to look like and because we use chat gpt when it came to writing out this description over here hosting this ai builder was able to put all of this information in the necessary places for example discover practical knowledge and strategies to manage your personal finances etc etc and all of this information over here too but bear in mind that this is just the first draft and you're going to have to Go through the entire site before you make it live because we can also see over here there's no logo so we're going to have to make a logo we're going to have to go through all of the images and change anything that we're not happy with but when it comes to editing anything you're going to be able to do that by clicking on continue to edit and from the stage we're now going to be able to click into any of these different elements whether it's the text whether it's the images and if we wanted to change anything, it's going to be really, really easy because all we need to do is click on change image just like this. Click on replace image and we're then going to be able to go through all of their different free images. We're going to be able to search for any type of image that we want. So the process to updating the website is going to take maybe a matter of 10, 15, 20 minutes, depending on how tech savvy you are. And when it comes to updating the logo, again, that's a very simple process because all you got to do is just click into it just like this, click on change logo just like that then you're going to be able to click on logo maker and then from here you're going to be able to type in your brand name type in any slogans that you want to what industry you're in so i'm going to do this now and show you what type of logos it was able to make me all right so it came back with all of these different logos that i can choose from and i'm going to be able to continue asking it for more and more logos but in this case i'm just going to select this one over here that looks like it has a money symbol and a tree and the name of the website so i'm just going to click into it just like this and click on download 
for free. And then I'm gonna be able to easily upload the logo just like that. So that took me another few minutes to do. And another way that ChatGPT is gonna be able to help with this whole process is when it comes to adding pages. Because as you can see, we've only got the one page over here, which is the blog page. But if you wanted to add another page, for example, about us that tells the visitor what the website is about, you can come over here to where it says pages and navigation, click on that. Then what you're gonna do is click on add page. And then from here, you're gonna select the about us page and select whichever one that you want. So in this case, I'm gonna select this one. And as you can see, Hostinger puts this placeholder text over here that doesn't necessarily relate to our situation because they just wanna give us an idea of what it's going to look like. But if you wanted ChatGPT to write out an About Us page for you, so you can come back onto it just like this and type in something like, can you write a 200 word About Us page for my website, Millennial Money Hacks? The company is based in London and our goal is to help millennials understand personal finance. And of course you can add in as much information that you want about your company. I'm just making it brief just so that you know how the process works. And instantly ChatGPT was able to come back with this entire About Us page. So I'm gonna be able to copy all of it just like this. Come back over here just like that. Click on edit text, highlight all of this and just paste it in there just like that. And if I wanted to get an idea of what it's going to look like on someone's mobile phone, I'm gonna be able to select this option. And this just gives me an idea of what the page is going to look like if someone was scrolling through it. But of course there's so much more that goes into building an affiliate marketing website. For example, how to place affiliate links throughout all of your articles, how to write articles in the first place, and everything that goes into getting your website ranked on Google so that you're gonna be able to build up traffic and make affiliate commissions in your sleep. So if you wanted to watch a completely free webinar where I break down my story of exactly how I was able to go from zero to over $100,000 in profit with my affiliate marketing business, you're gonna be able to watch that webinar by clicking the first link in the description down below. And if you also wanna watch another YouTube video that I made recently where I break down some other important things that you need to know when it comes to making money online as a complete beginner, then you're gonna be able to watch that YouTube video by clicking the link right there. Make sure you check that out straight after this because it's already helped out so many people and I'm sure that it's gonna help you out too. All right guys, I'll see you on the next one. Make sure you stay safe out there. Peace.